Hey guys, today I wanted to do a video about white willow bark um, and the whole process of it. Um, I was able to go out to Janet's house and get some um, some branches from her tree. I only took a couple. Um, it's really important that we don't like take too much from something because, you know, we want it to stay there um, and we want to respect it. So I, this is what it looks like. Um, I wish I had taken pictures of what the whole tree looked like so you could identify it, but I didn't. So you can just look up white willow bark identification um, and you could find that pretty easy. But this is what it looks like and it makes these little, she called it little rabbit's feet and it is very fuzzy and, and cute and it makes me not want to cut it, but I have to. <laughs> um, and so I'm going to just show you guys the whole process. So... I'm not very good at this. Okay, so I have this sharp little knife that I like to use, and I'm just going to strip it like this. Please don't worry about my fingers, I promise I'm okay. <laughs> um, and I just take it all off, and so, and you just get it there. I have a bunch that I've already done here. Um, and I just kind of get it in little strips so that it will dry out easier, um, for keeping. So I'm not going to use all of this right now. And I wanted to have a bunch, um, on hand for whenever I do need it or when someone else needs it. Um, I have this awesome little pot that my husband got me. You stick the water in there, in this guy, stick the herb that you're going to use in there. Um, put it in there. And then you boil it. So for this tea, um, you want to boil it for 10 minutes and then you want to let it steep for like 30 minutes. Um, you need, I would say, like if you were in a lot of pain, I would drink like a cup to a cup and a half. The white willow bark, there are different willow trees. Most of you know like weeping willow. There's white willow, there's black willow. Um, they're easily found by water in Ohio, um, and white willow is the best. So the reason this is so amazing is because it has, um, the, the same ingredients. <laughs> I can never say it right. Psilocyde, um, which is what's in aspirin. And so it's nature's pain relief. So, um, check it out. Give it a try. Tell me what you think. Um, and I'll let you guys know later how this tastes because hopefully it doesn't taste terrible. <laughs> See you later. Bye.